The overall goal of the following experiment is to measure the elastic modulus of living cells using an atomic force microscope. This is achieved by first performing AFM4 spectroscopy measurements at various locations on the cell. As a second step, every force distance curve is analyzed to determine the point where the AFM tip initially makes contact with the cell. Next, starting at the point of contact, the first 200 to 300 nanometers of indentation data are fitted to the Hertz model in order to extract the elastic modulus. The results yield a 2D map of the cell stiffness obtained by using the force mapping mode where each pixel represents a single force distance curve. Demonstrating the procedure will be Gwen Thomas, a graduate student from my laboratory. To begin this procedure, clean the cantilever holder with 70% ethanol and allow it to dry. Then load a Brooker DNP10 cantilever into the AFM according to the manufacturer's instructions. Next, calibrate the inverse optical lever sensitivity. This parameter describes the amount of photodiode response in volts per nanometer of cantilever deflection. To accomplish this, first load a clean glass slide onto the sample stage, install the AFM head, and adjust the laser beam and alignment according to the manufacturer's instructions. Once aligned, engage the AFM tip on the glass slide. With the piezo withdrawn, realign the mirror to a photodiode reading of negative 2 volts. Then, perform a force spectroscopy measurement with a maximum photodiode response or trigger point of...